Good morning campers, Johnny here, coming at you from the shores of the Red River of the North. Got gun smoke on the TV. Got the coffee brewing. Today's a good day. <laughs> Freaking love that show. Old Marshall Dillon. All right. Good to get this coffee done here. The uh, French press is working out tremendously. I really like that. Is I mean, because with, for instance, with with the instant coffee, I have to heat the water up anyways. So if I have to heat the water up anyways, I'm not really losing any time, or there's not really any ad added extra steps here, other than having to carry coffee with me and scoop it in there and wait for it to do its thing this is a quite an improvement over my previous system I'm glad I glad I uh, decided to try this out uh, the antique shops were kind of a bust yesterday not much for antiques in this area uh, thrift stores we went, I went to a thrift store when I was doing laundry the other day over there in North Dakota there, buddy. <laughs> Not too good either. They got this store, it's like, uh, reminds, from what I see in the pictures, it's like surplus store or something like that. Reminds me of like what a surplus city would be back where I'm at. So we're going to go check that out today. It's really all I have planned. Probably be a short video, but... Yeah, we'll take you along. Yeah! <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, so we get used to get MeTV uh, in where I live. And 1 p.m. Eastern... Gun smoke every day. I'd wake up and have my coffee in the morning, and I don't need that toad. I need the other one. Wake up, have my coffee, and one o'clock was gun smoke time. And then the rifle one came on, but yeah. And then uh, we don't get me TV anymore. They, I guess, didn't want to renew their contract or whatever. So that was the end of gun smoke. I haven't seen gun smoke in a number of years now. Because, you know, I don't get cable. I only get uh, TV at home. No cable, no uh, internet or nothing. So, yeah, it's nice to see Gunsmoke again. I'm probably going to let this on for a while. <laughs> I love Festus, too. <laughs> he reminds me of someone up in the holler. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm going to get a... I think I'm going to make a breakfast skillet this morning. Yeah, I have one of those um, adventure meals. I'm going to have that, I think just in the mood for it today hey guys so well first off it's a bust on the surplus store there i happened to get on their facebook page it said to close today and tomorrow so no dice there and uh they got the three s's all scattered all around so this building here is the bathroom building it's right by camp fender bender here and then for the second s i have to go all the way down to this other building here it's about halfway across the park and then for the third S, I got to come back up here to this building because they don't have any mirrors or nothing in that shower building. It's just like you go in the door and it's just a shower room. That's it. It's a plain old shower. So bouncing me all over the place to get take care of these three S's here. Oh, well. So uh, take that into consideration if you're coming over here. A little intel for you. All righty. Well, we got the first S out of the way. <laughs> I think I'm going to do a little work and get a little greasy before the second ass. I put this poop box back in here and then we'll get busy. Hey guys, made her back to camp. Uh, stopped at Joanne Fabrics, got a couple things. Um, went to Walmart, got some ice, uploaded the last video. And uh, got a half yard of black outdoor fabric. I'm going to sew the extension on my bug screen. I listed these two extra pieces of uh, puzzle mat foam on the marketplace for free. And uh, I had a few hits right away. The first hit was this. It appeared to be a female. 
messaged me a little bit, and then I had a guy message me right away. I said, you're second in line. This first one, I don't know what the deal was. She expressed interest and then left the chat. Well, she expressed interest. I said they're hers. I told her where they were. Then she left the chat. So I'm like, no, nah, homie, don't play. So I reported that profile and moved on to the next person. They're on their way right now to come get them, to get them out of here. Um, I hate to throw them in the garbage, you know, but I have no use for them. So I'm, I'd rather just give them away to someone. So that's what I'm going to do. And uh, if they don't show up, summarily they said they were on their way so if they uh, don't show up then i'll move on to the third person marketplace love it for the most part except for the scammers and them people overseas that are trying to scam you out of money and all them poor princes or rich princes rather that just need so uh, you know there's so many scams out there you got to be careful you got to be careful because there are more money, more people out there wanting to take your money than actually are decent people, it seems. So, it comes with the territory. You just have to be smart about it. I'm going to sit here and get rid of these, and then um, I don't know what. I don't know what to do. I have a little exhaust work to do. My crossover pipe is up way too close to my transmission. So I'm going to loosen all the exhaust bolts and stuff and lower that crossover pipe down to where I'm more comfortable with it being. That's what I've been putting off since I left home. Since we're so far away from home, I want to mitigate that uh, problem before it come, becomes a problem. So that's pretty much the last thing on my to-do list besides this mosquito screen. And then it's just hanging out and enjoying the sights and sounds of northwestern Minnesota with a D. So, probably be it for this video. Sorry we didn't get to see too much stuff, but uh, I guess we'll just consider this like a diary entry. See you tomorrow.